I've been doing research in the last few years on the voice of women in popular music. Looking at top 40, I took all the songs that women sang in the 20th century and analyzed the lyrics. And what I learned about women from popular music, about their role in society, the home, and the workplace, I'll be sharing with you today. I spent my early years inhabiting the late 50s and the early 60s. I listened to a lot of radio, watched television, bought records. What were the messages I heard back then? Things like, as long as he needs me, or alone, so alone that I could cry. I want to be wanted. Or how about, where the boys are, someone waits for me. And don't forget, stand by your man. But then if you fast forward to the late 80s and early 90s, you can see how far we've come. By then, popular music had women being urged to get on their feet and make it happen with or without a man. Two or three girls as he that he likes as well as me, but I love him. A common theme that came in popular music was he dumped me. Why do the birds go on singing? I wake up in the morning and I wonder. the world changed for women in the past century? The answer can be found in the lyrics of your favorite songs. A new book called Respect, Women in Popular Music looks through history at the evolving role of American women as seen and heard through the changing messages of pop music. The author, Dr. Dorothy Marsick, is joining us right now. It's nice to have you here. You're a Thank local you. person I am. With, uh, who's written 12 books, but yes. this one I think yes. probably is geared more toward the masses perhaps yes. than some of the others that you've written that are a little more business oriented. Yeah.